gonna be fine. Keep going. Hey! What's up? We at it again. This is Rockanam Bam TV Breathing Movement. We here with the one and the only Mom. The Black Bruce Lee. Let's have good time. Yeah, we back at it again. We hope everybody is doing good, right? Got Christmas coming up tomorrow. We got Kwanzaa coming up, and we got a new year. But most of all. It's a blessed new day. So we got to give it up for that. It's so glad to good to see you again, Madison. Girl, How you, you feeling? Too. What's going on? I'm breathing. That was, I see you in form. This is beautiful. Hey. So what you, what you want to talk about today? We want to tell well, the people. There's a lot of things I want to talk about. I'm going to say something about the system right now. There's nothing we can it. do about it, but just live it. The job and digging skin we in, but we got to stay together. United we stand, divided, divided we, we fall. fall. If niggas came together, they'd be better brothers. People, people, period, all over the world, right? That's true. Your mind shouldn't have no color, but ignorance and intelligence don't mix. You can't combine the two like oil and water. True, true, true. Hey, knowledge is fixed in time. So it's good to know things. So we here to help. And uh, just to show y'all, we the same like y'all. But we just trying to be better human beings. Right. So that's a, a wonderful some great motivation you know we talk about giving which we should be doing it every day yeah. all day not just during the holidays and the season we that's give true. thanks and we give and we share and sometimes we don't have we might not have money to give yeah, or tangible true. things to give love. right but it's what you receive and it's it, true it could just be in the form of wisdom right that's it true. could be training it could be some new dance moves uh, some new technique some new culinary new recipe some some body it could be technique. a hug from somebody a hug a, a compassion you know what i mean right you know we've been fooled so many times in our in our in our lineage but we sold ourselves out first back in the days we got an opportunity to be better and get stronger and what we got to do as a whole race and as a community we got to just like uh submit and believe in God or Allah or Jehovah and let them know that if you wake us up, do things with your life. Mm -hmm. Don't be sad and miserable, go hurt nobody else because you sad. Mm -hmm. Don't do that. Well, what we what we think about time, Manson? Don't waste time because time is what life is made out of. Mm, deep, deep, deep. Manson, is there anything that you want people to know about you? Some things that people don't know about you? You want to well, share? it's a lot and it's kind of like... Go ahead, the floor is yours. I, one thing for sure, I'm not perfect. Now, uh, I did some awful things, but now I won't do them anymore. But I knew they were bad. A lot of people out here know they're wicked now, and these kids need better father figures. You know, they don't have to lead these kids in the wilderness. Because then they're going to be coming at us, and they ain't going to last too long. Because knowledge is continual. Show them, let them read the books. You know, teach them. A mama can be a man, but a, and a man can be a woman, but the kids got to know they're never alone. Stay on they ass. Stay on it. Like, All day, every day. Like, like flies on that stanky stuff. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like some bees on some honey. Yeah, never <laughs> never lie. Like yeah, some make it stick. cheese on macaroni. Yeah, like yeah. some mayonnaise and it's bread on bologna. They don't want to teach, teach you this. <laughs> Ain't nobody supposed to raise your children. They not, they not, no. You you don't raise children, you rear them. You raise vegetables. What were some of your fondest memories, Masson, growing up? Well, it was like how my mother uh, migrated from the South, came up here, had me, and took care of me, and made me go to school to learn. You know, I didn't want to go there. It was whooping my ass. Right. Okay, so when did you, at what age did you get into boxing, uh, 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 kickboxing? Well, I what, didn't what, get that, that was years later. I was already okay. fighting and trying to defend my mama. About uh, what age was that that you could say you actually started training and you got into, you know, your first About 14 fight. years old. About 14, okay. Then I got my black belt in. I, mean, I used to be a junior police, I don't tell people that. <laughs> I went to a program. A junior police, it, okay. It, 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 was, three, it was 300 students. <coughs> me. But then... It went down to 10. I got my black belt at 16. Okay. Do you remember uh, where you trained at and who was one of oh, your Oh, yeah, first church, team? Mount Pisgah. Okay. Right on, uh, in, in Chicago. The city of Chicago. Okay, Chicago, Illinois. But it wasn't that. I started hanging out, teenager, preteen, gang banging, or whatever they were doing. 
Well, then my friends started getting their butts whipped. Mm -hmm. I said, hey, man, I can't defend y'all. Mm -hmm. I went to school, but then I went back mm -hmm. at 19, and, and my friends were doing the same routine. So what would you say was your, uh, your what was your first international fight? Do you remember what year it was oh, and where yeah. you went to? I mean, I had retired, I mean, but transpired is, mm -hmm. after I was, uh, I, 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 I became cold for being on my mother's boyfriends up in the hood, but she said, baby, you're too dynamic, and you need to do something else with your life. Mm -hmm. I said, okay, so I did the karate thing, and woo, woo, woo. But then I was too, I was too dynamic. I was doing that ha, 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 point. I, was like, I said, I can't do that. Mm -hmm. So uh, Mr. Preston Baker, my grandmaster, made, just made me a 50 degree uh, about uh, two months ago in his organization. He mm -hmm. said, you're too dynamic, man. You, you, you need to do some full contact and let it go. Mm -hmm. I said, man, there's some, I said, there's some bad Caucasian dude. I don't know if I can do that, sir. Mm -hmm. So what transpired was, I started working with them in training, and I learned and started whooping them. Mm -hmm. Then all of a sudden, our father superstar, mm -hmm. Rick that? Rufus, mm -hmm. and he, I should have fought him. It was the long, it was where we had fought before, but no, stars don't fight superstars. So I did that, mm -hmm. and then uh, what transpired? Did I you got, win? No, I, I lost by majority decision. I was all embarrassed. I said I'm gonna get me a mechanic job and all that. So my mama came back for taking her back her, her money. My grandma, she told me, you know what? You better not quit. Mm -hmm. So I gave a verbal agreement to Japan to fight a new sport called shoot boxing. So was that? Can you say that again? Shoot boxing. A verbal shoot agreement. Boxing. I gave an agreement to a guy. The shoot boxing is a new league. Punch. Mm -hmm. They're talking punch, kick, or throw. It was season. So I had never did that stuff before. So I had said okay. And then all of a sudden, I went to Japan, and then. Did, boy, blew him out the water. Mm -hmm. What year was that? Uh, 1989. Mm, okay. And then I fought so much and started like 20, in, in front of 20,000 people, but I fought, I fought so well that they ran out of Japanese like eggs. Mm -hmm. Then they went and got their ties. That's mm -hmm. why I'm a Thai killer. Mm -hmm. So who who gave you that name, Thai killer? Where did, where did that name come from? Me. Okay. Because they used to sell their kids to the gym at 14. Okay, so and tell me this. Ass. Tell everybody what are some of the names that you know them by. The Muay Thai Killer. Thai Killer. The Invisible Man with Clothes On. The Black Bruce Lee. Uh, the Man with No Clothes On. Uh, the Man with No Clothes On. Why did they say The Man with No Clothes On? Because I'm invisible. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So, no, no, no. Just, the main thing is just Manson, damn it. Manson, just Manson, damn it. I can see that on the shirt. Just Manson, damn it. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. Now, there's some things that people don't know about you. You... Did you go? To, did you attend college? Yeah, I, I went to uh, Illinois Technical well. College. But mm -hmm. it wasn't that. I signed out of gym. Mm -hmm. I had demoed in, in high school. I was in mm -hmm. So the thing was, I signed into a a regular school, but I didn't, uh, college, I didn't, I didn't get it. But then mm -hmm. I went to a technical school. Mm -hmm. I got a degree in electromechanical computer engineering technology. Uh, what what kind of degree was that? Electromechanical computer engineering technology. No, so you, you, oh, what college did you attend? Uh, Illinois Technical College okay. on, uh, in Chicago, downtown. Okay. okay. And then what transpired Wonderful. is, I was I was doing my martial arts. Somebody picked me up. They started seeing me. They was in karate, but they was in the suburb. I, I'm, I'm a black white boy. I live in Elmo Park. Black and, white. He's a black white boy. Okay, yeah, a real ahead. one. <laughs> so I was I was. They took a liking to me. They told me, you know, you come on our team. So they was getting me for a little while. I was moving, they do whatever, blah, meow, meow, meow. But the thing was, every fight I fought as an amateur to a pro, I was the main event. So mm. they put me up, made me feel good. You know, but the thing was, it wasn't just that. The thing is that they should have compassion for, for people. You know what I mean? And then one time, this is this is no lie. Come back to they, the mm -hmm. One time, this is no lie. And I don't like telling the truth too much, but. <laughs> They came in my neighborhood on, 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 on the low end. Who was that? We brought all these kids to scare them. Um, uh, frankly, my, my, my manager at the time. And he, he, he took them to the hood. They had never seen like much more than one or two black people. He said, look, if you be bad, this is what's going to happen to you. Look at all these people. Look at the guy is crying in the car. Ah! So he brought us a turkey for Thanksgiving. All right. We got the turkey. I was like, thanks, Frank. You're like a little bee. So we, we set the turkey in a uh, sink. All right. 
Two days later, it was a hole in the turkey. A, a, a big ass rat that bit a big hole in it. Wait, why was the turkey sitting in the tub? You know, we, we was throwing it out. Oh, that's a long time to be throwing it out. I mean, the I mean, it was a big turkey. So when I, we saw the hole in it, we told the rat, we're going to get you. <laughs> so what we did, we set the rat. It was a big old, old like one of the real ones, like a cat rat. A cat rat. Yeah, a cat rat. <laughs> a cat rat. Ma, he That's had been around, so we had, uh, like a we had, no, yeah, we had to close all the entrances off to, and bait them. Mm -hmm. So, uh, he, he snuck on out, everybody, all my sisters and my mom. So he kind of figured something was up. So we had to have, get the bro, whap, whap, whap. Oh, he ain't no oh, turkey no oh, more. Oh. Wow. What a story. Now, was this during the holidays? Yep, and up there. So, this, are we, Manson Gibson with his holiday tales, and he stayed tale, not tale. telling a lie. I know I ain't telling a lie. Wow. That's okay. a nightmare nice shoot. So, uh, what's what's for Manson in the future? Well, what I'm going to do is uh, promote and develop, but the thing is that they have to be worthy of me because I, I've been through so much that I got to explain it. Mm -hmm. All my buddies, my so-called, some of my best jokes are my friends. I laugh at them all the time. <laughs> a little Chinese movie. <laughs> it's growing, but we gotta help the, it's the children and the kids, but the thing is that these other people, I don't wanna pimp the sport. Mm -hmm. I just wanna be, I got a name for real, I'm messing. So Damn the thing it. is that I don't just wanna just squander it out there. Three daughters in college, I mean, they graduated from Harvard University, University of Illinois, they ride and ride and get it. Their mom and dad and my kids say, Dada, we love you. Mm -hmm. And So Manson is a father as well. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Yeah, I mean, that's what men's supposed to be. But the thing is that, don't, I mean, that, you know, live life, don't let life live you because what happens in time, you, your, day, your day is going to come. But don't rush death, but don't act like you be conceited, like you're better than everybody walking around like, yeah, no around. I'm Billy Bobo. Man, get your behind out of here. Mm. You just so, you move in. One thing that I really enjoy um, about Manson is that um, he's, he, he cracks me up a lot, you know, and humor is very medicinal. Oh, Definitely yeah, you gotta read that. medicinal. And um, it goes a long way. Yeah. A lot of wisdom from him. Sometimes when I'm not feeling good, he'll pick me up about the things that. that he say over the phone. So I appreciate that. So with that said, no, let me finish now. Okay, go ahead. I met her through Lineage. Come back this way so they can see you. I met her through Lineage. This, this ain't no one. This ain't this ain't no one night stand. <laughs> no, uh, no, uh, no. Uh, <laughs> I mean they don't train me. All right, get back to know. <laughs> her uncle used to train me, and uh, it's a lot. I'm gonna cut to the chase. Come on, I promise. One day, I, I was doing my thing, going to Australia or Africa, where I was going. I was just training on my own. And then some guy came in, old oh, big shot, like, man. He came in with the cameras and all this in the gym in the city. And he's going to look like, yeah, he said, man, over there playing them checkers. Ha, ha, ha. Look at him now. That used to be my trainer. I said to myself, I said, if I ever get an opportunity, I'm going to take him with me. I wind up taking him around What's his the name? World. Uh, his name was uh, Afonso. Afonso. Uh, 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 Afonso. Weatherwall. Also known as Fonz. Yeah, but then what happened though, it's funny without being funny. So I got a chance to get my passport back. So me and him went to Jamaica. He was so happy to go to Jamaica. He left the damn hand pass. He left the what? He left the hand pass. Oh my goodness. And I've been out of sight of England, but I miss him. He's one of the greatest trainers I've known. And everything he taught me, I absorbed it. Can we get one of your famous? Can you? Would you like to give the the um, the viewers one of your signature moves? Okay. Since we're in a holiday and this is the season, and people are giving, even though we're supposed to do that all the time. Come over here, I'm going to show us something. All right, here we now, go. If you bother me in the wing, that's different. But it's, now, let me let, on, on, Don't on. hurt me now. No, no, no. Listen. Hey, look. So let me, let me put my mask on. Yeah, yeah, you better put some masks on. Man. Put my, my mask on. Hey, this is my cold. It's all this about this being healthy, hood. right? <laughs> this is my hood move. It's cold as hell. Hood move. All right, here we go. People think they're looking at me. They, I'm looking at them. So what I do is, it's just simple. They be walking up on me. So I say, stop. Okay. 
He said, why are you poking me in my eyes? I said, oh, I didn't know I hurt your eyes. Oh, my goodness. Yes, you did, sir. You called me in my eyes. Oh, wait a minute. No, but then they say, I say, you see that over there? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's over there. Let's get to running. That's it. Now, what you call that again? Oh, that's the replay. What's that called? That, that, did they, was that your signature move? Yeah, yeah, that was the first one. And okay. then I do the dish one. Oh, look at that. Oh. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Nice okay. That's a nice tree, wrap. Right? <laughs> you know. We hope that you all enjoyed. All right, thank you. Just taking some time out to um, speak to the viewers. Yeah. I appreciate all the people that like my videos. I appreciate Me it. Me and Madison get some videos. We're going to bring them out. Definitely. Um, got I know a lot of people say, man, so they call you and they can't get through. Oh, but, well, get through her. Well, contact me and I'll get in touch with him or All you right. can link him on Facebook. Try to leave him a message that way. Uh, Manson is available for training. Oh, uh, anytime. He's available for training. If you, uh, workshops, yeah, um, whatever. Some of you all have been hitting me up saying that you want to do a documentary on them. Get in touch with me and we're gonna make that happen, okay? So uh if you thank you very thank you thank you very much. Hope you enjoyed. If you enjoyed, if you enjoy our videos, please yes, hit us up. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. We'll really appreciate that. So uh we're gonna go ahead on and end. And uh we wanna just say enjoy yourself. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Thank you. God bless y'all. Peace. Peace. One move for the road. Bye-bye-bye. Yeah! Wow. Let's go.